That's a nice one. Hi, it's a multifarious fisherman. I'm out here in the flooded out office. I am here today to talk to you about a new acquisition. I got a new fly rod. It's a St. Croix Legend Elite fly rod. It is a nine foot four weight rod. It brand new. I've, I've not owned a St. Croix fly rod before. I have a couple of sages, which I am a big fan of. I got a good buddy that works at St. Croix and that is a big fly caster. He loves these rods and I needed a four piece. I've got a fly rods a little older and they're two piece, which it's tough to find any two piece rods anymore. After 9-11 and TSA and flying with rods, everybody pretty much runs a four piece fly rod anymore, but I'm still rocking some old two pieces. And this is the first time this has gone together. I'm going to give you my first impressions and tell you about my excitement of having this rod because I think it's going to be great. The Sage that I throw has a certain characteristic. It's an XP, it's an older rod. It's it's really good. The performance of it's really good. It uh, does a number of things well. It's very accurate short cast and it's got a lot of power to push a fly out a long ways. I'm not expecting this to be quite as much power on the long end, but to be honest with you, I don't necessarily need that real often. We do have a little wind today, so there will, there will be that to deal with. It might make it a little more fun. We'll see. I've got a little sage reel rigged up from my other outfits. already got four weight on it. It's one of the reasons I, I bought a four weight rod too was so that I could have a setup where I could just swap the reels back and forth. I wanted four piece. I already have the two piece. Gives me some options and they'll behave a little differently too. I busted that out the other day, but I want to I wanna throw it. I want to catch some fish. I got a little storm coming in. I got some wind, so it's not going to be ideal conditions, but if you wait till like ideal conditions, Never gonna fish. I'm not waiting. I'm gonna fish. Ooh, he's angry. A nemesis fly. Four weight St. Croix Legend Elite. Not a monster. Fun on a four weight though. Especially when they're biting aggressively like that guy was. He chased it down. Sorry about the wind. It's made the fly rod a little bit more of a challenge, but not fun if you're not challenged. I mean, it's fun, but if you live where I live, in the plains, sometimes it's going to be windy. And by sometimes, I mean about 80%. Or maybe higher. Oh, they're just platters. Got him. Well, that's a nice one, too. Nice fish. Boy, this one's got a lot of orange all the way down his body. Pretty colors. It's a long cast, longish anyway. Yeah, it'll put it out there. I think that's a crappie, and I think it's a real nice one. That is a giant crappie. That is beautiful. <laughs> the last fish I caught was this fish. <laughs> that is a giant crappie. 
Look at that fish. Holy smokes. Look at the size of that mouth. I mean, that's a nice male there. I mean, they are chasing it down. Look at the colors on that gill. Giant ear flap, blue chin, orange, orange breast, brassy sides, a little purple on there. It's just beautiful. I'm running streamers for these gills. And they are smacking them. Tell you what, I'm pretty happy with this St. Croix. Pretty happy with this little Nemesis fly too, black and purple. It's kind of a different color for me. I don't, but it's overcast today, and I thought, man, a dark, a dark fly might be money. Well, guys, Legend Elite fly rod, Nemesis fly, bedding bluegills. Look at that tank oh man. See the color of this fish. Gorgeous. God, that's a nice gill. Enjoying this fly rod. I think we talked about it already, but big fan.